Peter Cater makes it look so easy. His music is part classical, part jazz, part new age, and all from the heart. He has a new CD. It's called Rapture. It's one of more than 60 he's recorded since the early 80s. Well, I started in the music business when we were recording to two-inch tape. And then now we're, you know, we've all got home studios. It's all digital. We went from, uh, you know, vinyl and cassettes to CDs to streaming. And uh, I love the learning curve. I think true creativity comes with a combination of curiosity and humility. There's a music video that goes with Rapture. It showcases his love of nature and his talent, which earned him 13 Grammy nominations before he finally won one, and then another. The 13th nomination, I'm sitting there and I'm thinking, probably not gonna win, right? And when they called my name, it was, honestly, it was amazing. It was, I almost went into a kind of shock. As impressive as his Grammy winning career has been, it is something else that caught my attention. Peter has played theaters and concert halls all around the world, but decided he wanted to do some very small intimate shows at his house in Boulder. So through doing these home concerts for like 10, 20, 30 people, people started getting closer and closer to the piano and they finally, someone just got underneath the thing. And it began this whole thing of like, who's gonna get under the piano next? So I had to do it, right? Yeah. You get under the piano, you put your head on the pillow and stretch your body out that way. Okay, all right, let's give this a try. This is probably easier when I was younger. I have never seen the bottom of a piano. I did not know it looked like this. All right, then what? Now Peter invites people to come to his home, lie under his piano as he improvises music just for them. He comes up with the music based on personal conversations beforehand. He records the session and gives it to them. He calls it personal piano readings. I do attract a lot of people that are struggling with something, either health issues or emotional issues, or just want some sort of affirmation for their lives and who they are, some sort of reflection musically. And I gotta tell you, the view isn't much, but the sound under a grand piano is amazing. Peter calls it a sound bath. You feel the music vibrating all around you. Oh, that sounds so good. <laughs> just... Oh my gosh, what a great story. So you can book personal piano reading, buy his CDs, or check out his concert schedule at his website, petercater.com. And as always, if you have a story that is positively Colorado, shoot Gary an email.